Hey you guys, Facebook world. Um, happy Friday. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day already. Um, our day has gone off to kind of a slow start and now Emery is taking a nap. Parker's having a little playtime and my hair is kind of a mess. So anyways, I wanted to hop on here because I had something on my heart and something that I've been dealing with a lot lately. And I just wanted to share it because I'm going to say it time and time again, but I am um, living my life out loud, right? So I have this whole thing that I do. It's called Her Life Out Loud. And it's funny because recently I have not been Her Life Out Loud. I've been really um, struggling lately. So I'm just going to put it out there. Struggling in like, who am I? What am I doing? I'm not successful enough. I'm not, you know, um, I'm not good enough in my business or motherhood or whatever that is, right? So I have decided um, that I was gonna, this this morning I just woke up and this thing keeps popping in my head, the saying of be unapologetically you, right? Be who you are. And um, it's interesting because recently I'm like, well, what is this person doing? How do I, how do I, you know, do what she's doing to be successful. How, oh wait, what is this person doing in motherhood that she's doing this great, amazing thing and being a mom? And I'm over here like pulling myself in 15 directions and this could be anything in your life. I'm just saying it's definitely motherhood for me and just life right now for me. Um, trying to pull and grasp at like everything everyone else is doing and then I forgot that I am me, right? I say that a lot, but there was a moment where I'm like, I believe it but I'm not doing it for myself. So be you. And what that means is be who you were created to be. Um, for a long time, I've been afraid to share my heart um, and who I am and thinking that I'll be judged um, for thoughts or for things that I believe in. Um, for me, I was a little nervous like even in this business, oh, I'm afraid to share, like, this is what I'm doing, even though it's a massive part of my life, right? This is huge for my life, for my family's life, um, for my confidence, for other women, and being a leader. Um, but I was afraid to almost share it because I'm like, oh, people are going to think I'm stupid and that all I'm trying to do is sell them something when I'm not. Because most people come to me because they want it, right? But, um... I have been kind of afraid to like talk about the things that I've been really wanting to talk about and like oh maybe I'm going live too much or maybe I'm posting too much and the reality is is I am me and I'm going to share my heart I love social media in the sense that I can pour into people um, I can chat with people I get to meet women from all over the place and I think that it is an amazing, an amazing opportunity to use social media that way. It's like 90 degrees, but I have the hair on, but I'm going to just do a messy, crazy hair today. Anyways, my heart is to share, and I'm going through the same thing. Aw, Christina, I love you so much. Yes, girlfriend. You are beautiful, girl. You are beautiful. Um, and I can't wait to see what God has planned for your life. Marilyn in the house, whoop, whoop. <laughs> um, so, you guys, I, there's something that excites me. There's something going on in my life that is fueling me to, you know, push past these fears, to push past this fear of judgment or this fear of people um, thinking a certain way of me and really realizing that if I don't live my truth out loud, if I don't live who I am and those desires in my heart, then I'm not being me and how am I supposed to inspire and help other people, right? Because I completely 1000% believe that all of us have a story to share, all of us have a journey, all of us are here and we're this the piece of a puzzle to this beautiful, amazing world and the amazing people around us. So, um, anyways, I just wanna encourage you to be you, to be bold, to be beautiful in your own beautiful way um, to get excited about life, to pursue life in such a way that you are going after your goals and your dreams, even though they seem kind of scary or they don't seem like that's, you know, that's not what the rest of the world is doing, right? Um, go against the grain if that's what you know you're supposed to be doing. Um, for me, 
I am doing this business not for the money, but I need the money to do what I want to do in my life, right? Um, I am sharing my life out loud because I believe that I am worth something to someone that I'm able to share and um, speak truth into their life. So that is why I get on here, right? But then there is that moment where I'm like, I'm afraid, I'm scared. Oh, the fear, the, that fear and that scared like gets inside me and then I'm not being who I truly am. And I'm like, well, what are they doing? And I'm pawing at everything else because, well, someone is better than me, right? Instead of being like, I'm a badass. I'm really cool. I am my own person. I am my own beautiful person. I am my own confident person. I am who I am and I am here and I am Lacey for a reason. That's why I'm not Christina. That's why I'm not Brittany. That's why I'm not so-and-so. Um, so I encourage you guys to start really pursuing what's in your heart of like, what is the core of who you are? What do you want, right? For me, I want to travel the world with my husband. I want to go work in orphanages. I want to go work in um, helping kids in our community and being an advocate to pursue dreams and to pursue passion for women and for girls and for, I mean, for anyone really. Um, so if guys are getting on here, pursue your dreams, right? I talked to my husband, what do you want to do? Um, but I want to make this world a better place. I want to be a ripple in this world in someone's life who's going to then um, be a ripple in someone else's life. Who It's going to, you know, that ripple continues on and it spreads, right? So for me, I'm no longer like I'm still working through it, but I want to shout to the rooftops of what I'm doing and get people excited and inspire people to live their life and their dreams and pursue their goals. And um, I think when more of us do that and more of us really just like sit down and say, you know what, I am going to love being me and I'm going to share my truth. I'm going to share who I am, you guys. It's amazing what we can do in this world. It's amazing what we can do to um, help other people, to inspire people, to light this fire in them, to make this world a better place. So I don't know, that is like whatever was on my heart. So I was just gonna jump on here, even though we're gonna go on a little kid date. Um, usually Ben and I take the kids out for a Friday date, so. You guys, you are all amazing. You are all so fantastic. And I cannot wait to see you guys start pursuing your dreams and your goals and those desires that God has put in your heart for a reason because you are you and you are beautiful. So happy Friday. Thanks for joining in. Uh, I hope you have a wonderful weekend. And I, uh, if you want to message me or help you, you know, work through your goals or whatever that looks like, I would love to help you. So bye you guys.